Hey babes, welcome back to another video. So today I am building a witch is house uh, using only Realm of Magic because it's Saturday and I do one pack videos most Saturdays and that's that's it. That's good job, Sarah. Uh, YouTube uh, level 10 out of 10. I don't know what any of that means. So yeah, I'm building a Realm of, Realm, Realm of Magic only witch is house. Uh, what does that mean? That means that I searched up Witch's House on Google and looked at pictures and built a mixture of those pictures. Uh, it's very different from uh, the style I usually do. I've never really done anything like this. I've never seen a house that looks like this style in real life ever. Usually I've seen real houses of... Uh, I've seen the house style that I do, at least, like, from exterior, even just driving past it. But this style, I have never actually seen in real life, ever. So, yeah. But I, I did the best I could. It's definitely very, very cramped. It's a lot smaller than my usual houses are, because I like a lot of open space. Uh, this does not have as much open space. It's definitely very cramped. It is a two-bedroom house. Uh, I have it for, like, a... a what well, I had it for was like a mother and a daughter or something like that. Uh, a teenage daughter, but you can do whatever you want with it. Like I always say, you can change it however you want. It is currently on the gallery. It's just called Witch's House. It's in Glimmer Book. Book. Glimmer Brook. Uh, it's the, it's the, it's on the uh, empty plot and empty plot, empty lot. Rip. Uh, this build took me a long time to do. I actually did a different floor plan. Uh, or no, not floor plan, exterior, but then I erased it, but I cut that out of the video because the video would have been like, I think it was, it was four minutes longer than this. And I was like, nope. So I cut out as much stuff as I felt comfortable doing. And, and so this is, this is real. This is me. I am exactly where I'm supposed to be now. I want to go home. So I actually really want to redo this house, uh, another time, like renovate it or something with all of the packs because you have no idea how much I wanted to use get together for this for this even if I just used get together my renovate this like it's all of this stuff just plus get together because I wanted to use the get together columns and the get together wallpaper and the get together decorations because I just uh based off of lots of the pictures I saw it would just fit that style a lot especially the columns oh I hate the base game columns I love the get together column, that just plain column. I love it so much. I use it every time I can. Anytime I'm not doing one of these one packs, or I mean, the occasion, it doesn't fit into the house, but like I'm always using it. And I really needed it for this house, and I'm kind of upset. But yeah, so I just uh, lay out the floor plan. Uh, I had a lot of like floating parts, a lot of like bump outs, because that's just what I saw in all of the pictures. That's. That's pretty much it. I wanted this to be sort of like a secluded, like in the forest or jung not jungle. Where am I? Uh, what's what's the other thing? Where am I? Why am I blanking? I don't know. The woods or something like that. Like it's just in the middle of nowhere. You know? Yeah. No. Maybe. I don't. I don't know. Uh. Yes. <laughs> Good job, Sarah. That is amazing. Thank you very much. So, uh, let's do the sneak peek for the week because this now this now. Bruh, now is as good a time as ever, I guess. Uh, so I'm actually going to do something different next week, and I'm going to have... I'm not going to do my regular schedule where I do, like, tiny tiny build Tuesday or room builds on Thursday. Uh, Saturday will still be whatever I end up doing on Saturday. I don't know. I think we're going to do a TV show house, but I don't remember. Um, I'm actually... I have this, like, townhouse build, and it's fit perfectly into four parts. And my weekday uploads four days. So uh, on Monday, you're going to be getting the uh, building of the actual like exterior of the townhouse. Uh, and then you're going to and then for the rest of the week, you're going to just get each townhouse decorated. And it's it's really fun. A lot of the videos are very long. I took a lot of time, but I really, really like the way they turned out. And I'm going to be uploading them each separately to the gallery. And I'm going to try to put them all on the gallery. But my idea was that if you wanted to play it, and I'm also going to make families for all of them too, so if you want to play. My idea would be that like, oh, you'd want the other ones to be empty. 
uh, and you just play with whatever, with whatever family. But if for some reason you feel like you want to play with all of them or you want to put like roommates in the other houses or something like that, I'm going to try. I don't know, but I know for sure that each individual one will be put on. Like, it will just be only that townhouse is furnished, but the lot will be the same for all of them. Make sense? No? I don't know? Uh, who knows? I definitely do not. So that is fun. Um, what is going on? I don't really know anymore. Uh, things and stuff. I don't know. This build, th my builds have been taking a long time. Like, my, the past couple of builds I've done have all, the shortest one has been two and a half hours. This one was almost four hours. The town, the last townhouse I did, which was on a uh, Thursday, was four hours and 15 minutes. I just decorated the interior like the floor plan was already done like the floor plan the floor plan was done all the lights and the floor was already in the entire exterior was already done all I had to do was decorate it and it took me four hours that is absolutely crazy so there have been some very weird glitches going on in the sims I'm sure you all have noticed but uh uh in this one uh the wallpaper was being all like uh, I don't remember how to function. Can you help? Uh, it was, you'll see it later. It, it was not doing what it was supposed to be doing. And that's been fun. I've also been, I, also, I, blah, I also finally got to play with, uh, I almost just said Island Living, Eco Lifestyle, uh, the, the new pack that just came out. And, uh, let me just say, uh, glitching, definitely. My, my sim, every time she went to go take a shower, she showered with her clothes on I, I was, it, and didn't change outfits. Like, I gave her different outfits because I, I like doing that. But she wouldn't change it to the, any of the other outfits. And she wouldn't, when it was, like, burning hot out, uh, not only would she not get the mood lit, but she also wouldn't automatically change into warm weather clothing, which I'm, like, 98% sure that that used to happen. You can correct me if I'm wrong. But that's supposed to happen, right? Like, and there were just a bunch of other things. Uh, like, my game was like, nope. Nope, 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 nope. Yes, thank you for listening to my TED talk. I don't know where I'm at. I am so sorry. I just spent a lot of time editing this video. It took me an hour to edit this video. It's a speed build, like who, who? Uh, but yeah, so that's that's been fun. I've just been cutting things off and then having to go back because I missed the point where I need to cut it off. And I am too much of a perfectionist to be doing any of this um that is that that's it that's that's all i got that's that's what we have that's it um so uh the 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 the, the, the like the, the 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 rounder roofs and stuff like that like the hexagon roof and all of those uh they're they are they have they always like shown the floor and have they always like when I was taking screenshots at the end, I had to, like, put the walls... I mean, I had to, like, put the level down because the, the roofing was clipping in, which was great. You can't see it from, any, from, like, gameplay mode or in build mode just when you're taking pictures and all of the levels are up. But, yeah, so uh, has that always happened? Is that a new thing? Am I dumb? Probably. So, yeah, that is... That, so, yeah, that is... What are you doing, Sarah? I really do not know. So, uh, my vision for, like, the people that live in here, I imagined it to be, like, an older female who's a witch, and her daughter, who I imagined to be, like, like, had just become a teenager, like, there's still, like, stuffed animals and toys all over her room, and her room, but, like, you can definitely see that, like, she's just starting to be a teen, and they're both witches, uh, they're, they're, like, gooder witches, the, uh, the, 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 the adult one. Hello? Dad? Hi, Jesse. Say hi. I love you. Okay, cool. I think that that was my sister. Uh, I was, she responded to one of those things. I know you couldn't hear her, but uh, yeah, I was basically just talking to myself there anyway, so it didn't even matter. Like, oh, the floor plan? 
the floor plan took me forever to figure out. Like, I kept moving things around. I moved the door around. I made the house bigger, actually, because it was too small. So I don't know if you've seen any of my other videos, but even when I do tiny houses, they are very, very open and not cramped because I cannot deal with cramped houses. Like, tiny houses are fine, just as long as there's lots of room to move around. When they're cramped, that's when I'm like, nope, 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 nope. And I was trying to figure out how to not make this cramped. But to still have things in it, I'm not... Like, and unless I'm doing tiny houses, my houses are usually pretty big. Let me just be honest. Even when I do smaller ones, they're still pretty big. Because I just like a lot of space to put things in to make sure I have everything. So things aren't really cramped. So, uh, yeah, I struggled a lot with this house in general and not making it bigger. I did make it bigger at one point. But that was just to fit the stairs in because I used a medium wall height on the first floor. Which I hate doing that in smaller houses because it makes the stairs bigger. And, ooh, and I was, but I really like the doors in a, in the medium wall height, and I never use the medium wall height, and I love these doors. I know I already said that. I don't care. Um, no, that's all I got. I don't have anything else to say about that. But, yeah, I was struggling with the floor plan a lot, definitely. Uh, yes, that is, that's, that's fun, Sarah. Good job, Sarah. Just. What are you doing with your life? I honestly do not know. Uh, I'm trying to, I almost just started talking about my townhouses because I obviously think it's Monday and we're working on the townhouses. Oh, my head, bruh. I just don't know anymore. Um, that is, that is great. So while I was building this today, I did build this today because uh, I forgot to build it on yesterday. On yesterday, who am I? I don't even know anymore. I was watching Psych, which is a TV show, and uh, it's a lot less, it's a lot less cringy, let me tell you. It's a lot easier to watch when you're half watching it, I'm gonna tell you right now. Like, I like the show, I, it, it, I don't know why I like the show, really. Like, it's not a supernatural show, which already means that, like, I have, like, a very low chance of liking it. Because non-supernatural shows, like, fantasy shows or anything, like, they just don't really interest me. I mean, like, it, guess it kind of is, because, like, psychic, but, like, he's not a real psychic. It, it doesn't count. If you've never seen the show... Uh, you, it's on Amazon, it's included with Prime, on Amazon Prime video thingy, whatever. Uh, you can watch it if you want. I, I wouldn't necessarily recommend it. I think I like it so much, because it kind of reminds me of, like, a mixture of, like, Dexter and Reaper. Like, it's, like, Dexter, it's one of those shows that I like. It's, like, a crime show, and it's not supernatural. Like, it's, like, kind of similar. They're from, like, around the same time. I think they're, like, a year apart. They're both, like, crime shows, you know? And they're kind of similar, and I like Dexter a lot, and then it kind of reminds me of Reaper, just because, like, he's not, like, well, he's not, like, really, really as, really as put together. What am I doing? I don't even know anymore. I'm gonna stop trying to explain myself and just leave that alone. And if you've never seen Reaper, I definitely recommend watching that. I loved it. I thought it was a great show. It has two seasons. Uh, as of now, it's, you can, it's free to watch on uh, ABC.com. So definitely check it out. It's only like, I think it's only like 24 episodes combined. And I really, really enjoyed it. I thought I liked all of the main characters, which is something that really doesn't happen very often. But I liked all the main characters. Even the, even like sometimes they annoyed me, but like I still liked them. And I thought it was really interesting. And uh, yeah, so that's, I definitely recommend watching that show. And if you've never watched Dexter, honestly, what are you doing with your life? It's currently on Netflix and you should watch it because it's really, really, really good. Like, if you want a good crime e show, watch Dexter. Uh, let me just tell you. Unless <laughs> you don't like blood or cursing or killing, then that might not be the show for you. But honestly, then a lot of shows wouldn't be the show for you. So yeah, that's that's just that's my opinion. Oh my gosh, Sarah, you need to calm down. Um, that's that's. That's correct. I don't even know what I'm saying that's correct to anymore. I don't even know what's going on. This is a terrible video. I'm going to tell you right now. My audios this week have just not been it. They've just not been it. And that's that's all I got. I don't know where that end was going. But that, that blah, 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 blah. my brain just exploded there. I am very, I am very apologized apparently. So I'm very apologized. Sorry about that. Ooh. 
I don't even know if you can hear me because I'm farther away than usual, but I turned my mic up a little bit, so hopefully it's not really, really loud because I know I scream a lot, but I'm trying not to scream because I know my dad's still working. And I'm talking really, really fast and I'm out of breath now, so that's fun. I tried doing terrain tool stuff, like the like the different terrain height, not the terrain paint, which I never do because I'm terrible at it and it makes me nervous. I don't. I think I ended up actually not using it whatsoever, but I tried and that's what the, counts. I tried putting a pond in the back because I, uh, I, I forgot that we didn't have ponds and they were fountains. So I just, uh, made the best with what I got. That doesn't make any sense. Uh, so they have a kitchen in their house, which is good because people need to eat, I think. Yeah. Uh, it's a small kitchen. Uh, let me just tell you how mad I am that the counters in that came with this pack don't have uh cabinets and i used those cabinets that came with the base game and little did i know that one the color very very oof i'm oof off and two they have like a stony thing and they bump out and oh it looked so bad in the screenshots and i very much regret it and why can't we just have cabinets we haven't had cabinets and so new cabinets in so long wasn't jungle the jungle adventures the last one to give us cabinets, am I? Yeah, that's 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 right. Because the island living ones didn't have cabinets, and the realm of magic ones didn't have cabinets. I think that's the last. Uh, those are the only other counters we've got since. Uh, what is it called, bro? Who am I? Um. Yeah. Jungle Adventures. Definitely, that is. I don't. I, I, yeah, so we also haven't gotten a lot of counters, but the counters we've gotten haven't had cabinets, and I guess so were those shelf things in, a Island Living, but, like, there's nothing for this one, like, and nothing matches either, like, okay, if the wood matched, if the wood swatches matched, like, another cabinet we had in the base game, then it would be fine, don't put cabinets in it, whatever, the woods don't match, there's not a single base game cabinet that the woods match the woods on in the in in the counters in in this pack i've been talking for this uh, for for about this oh my why can't i speak english today i've been talking about this for too long and i need to move on now and i i realized while building this that i hate the swatches in the realm of magic pack and they don't match like there's either those swatches that look like like the columns and the railings and stuff or there's like the swatches that that go with like the doors and the windows or there's the ones that are the furniture and some sometimes they don't match like there were a few things where like there weren't the same amount of swatches like i think the the cap the, the the curtains don't have the same number of swatches a bunch of things don't have the same number of swatches and so it's hard to match things and like the the curtains i used in the living room have a really nice blue but the couches don't have a matching blue and i'm like what 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 are you doing guys what are you doing um and i just don't know what they're doing at this point i have no idea what's going on. oh i put like the you aren't seeing this but i put like the uh the herbs in the door in the in the, in the archway and i love that so much i thought that was so cute i hope it's still usable i'm sorry if it's not if it's not just delete it delete it but i I, yeah, I thought it was like so cute and because it's medium wall height, I, they it won't they won't hit their heads, you know Yeah, I just put like a little chest table and the little like entryway on the stairs and stuff and a couch I was gonna put an easel, but there wasn't room for that that happened a lot I was gonna put things then there wasn't room for it uh, the, Honestly build uh, decorating this made me feel claustrophobic. I'm not gonna lie It also doesn't help that uh, only half of my couch is usable because there's so much stuff on here but I could clean that up, you know. I that is completely unrelated, and yeah, this weird rose thing goes around the entire, the entire second floor, so that's fun. You're not even seeing that anymore. What's the, even the point? What's the point? I don't even know. Um, I drop, 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 drop. Why, 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 why? So one of these things is not like the other. I don't. That's not no sarah what are you doing i i honestly don't even know anymore uh one of the rooms i used as an office then one of them is a bedroom then the other one's a bedroom and uh the last bedroom i did which i imagined would be like the adult's bedroom uh i didn't finish furnishing it uh 
I forgot to finish furnishing it before I went to go do the backyard, and it's still not... I mean, like, it has all the furniture it needs. It has, um... It has a dresser, and it has a bed, and, like, what else do you... And it has a chair, and, like, an end table. I didn't put a lamp on the end table, uh, and I... I I, I even put pictures up after that, and I didn't put a lamp in, like, what was that? It's not like it's unfurnished, I just didn't finish doing everything I wanted to do with it, and it's definitely very, very plain, especially compared to, like, the, the, the child's room, which is very, very decorated, but it's so much fun to decorate children's rooms and kitchens. The, all the kitchens look the same, but let me be honest, all the bedrooms really look the same, too, because we don't have enough clutter, um... We need a clutter stuff pack. I'm gonna tell you right now, I would buy it. I'd be the first one to buy it. I'd pre-order it. Like, I want a clutter stuff pack. Give it to us, please. We need more clutter. Don't abandon the clutter. It makes the house. Um, that is correct. I put, like, a shelfy thing. Are you even seeing this room anymore? I put, like, a shelfy thing in there, and there's, like, a radio, and, um, and tissues, and a lamp. And a plant and a wand holder. I put a wand holder, which uh, so she has a wand. That's that's great. That's good. That's that's amazing. Um, yes, <laughs> good job, Sarah. Uh, this is terrible audio, and I can't speak English, and I don't even know what's going on anymore. I'm just gonna tell you right now. Um, yes. Do I have anything else to talk about? No, uh, I have nothing to talk about literally ever. So, so, why can't I speak English today? Why, what is happening? I do not know. Uh, so, how have, how was your week, everybody? My week was pretty good, I'm gonna tell you. Um, uh, yeah, my week was good. I hope you all had a good week. I think I already said that. I have no idea what's going on. Oh, for, for I, I did something I don't usually do in the bathroom. I actually changed the color of the uh, toilet paper uh, holdery thingy, which I haven't done in forever. I don't know if I've even done it on my channel, actually. I don't even know. Uh, I've never used the sink uh, in the in that comes with this pack, besides in that um, in the I do every room a different pack, the second one. That's the only other time I've ever used the sink from Robo Magic because I think it looks really dumb. But yeah, I mean, it has toilet stuff, so that's pretty lit, I guess. Uh, a lot of people are all like, don't add any more bathroom stuff, don't add any more toilets. And I'm over here all like, but, but the selections we have are all the same and it makes everything look the same because all the good ones, you're only going to use the good looking ones. And so all your houses are going to look the same. I like variety. I like it that they keep adding it. But then again, I also don't have all of the toilets. Because I think there was a toilet that came with Strangerville. And a I know that there's one that came with fitness stuff. And I don't have either of those. I think there's another toilet that I don't have. I don't really know. I don't really pay attention to toilets. Sorry. Um, so, like, I don't have all... I, why am I only talking about toilets? I honestly do not know anymore. So there's one part later on where I, like, go into the gallery to try to find uh, the harvestables, like the plant stuff. And there's no Realm of Magic ones on the gallery. I look for a while. I even sped it up a little bit faster, so sorry if it hurts your eyes. Uh, when I go into the gallery, it is going to be a little bit faster than the rest. The rest? The rest? The rest of the video? Yeah, I also ended up putting like a tree in front of their window view, but I didn't realize it because the tree just went back to being its, like, non-existent self. So, yeah, that's, that's, that's all I got, but I tried, uh, searching it up, I tried a bunch of different things, and they just didn't have, uh, they didn't have any of the harvestables, so I just ended up doing empty planter boxes, so y'all can plant your own things if you play with this house. Yes, that is correct. So I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna wrap this up now because it's not gonna get any better than this. So I hope you all enjoyed this video. I would like to apologize because this audio sucks. Uh, I haven't had an audio this bad since like the beginning of my channel. But yeah, just, just, just bye. <laughs>